Good evening, Louise. What are we doing this evening? Going up Blackpool Tower because um, then we can like, see bonfire night, like fireworks. And... Yeah, it's bonfire night tonight, isn't it? There's the Blackpool Tower. We definitely didn't practice that. Well, you're wrong. Um, so, yeah, so we're going to go over the tower. It's dusk here, getting the shot. Uh, and then we're going to go up Blackpool Tower to see if we can see any fireworks and also to see the illuminations because we haven't been up the tower at night this season. So, we can see all the illuminations. So, they're switching on in about 10 minutes the illuminations we've got five o'clock to go up the tower uh, which is about half an hour off you can see the sun is just setting in a, a bit of a chilly blackpool today isn't it and it's due to rain later as well we normally go to a bonfire at the blackpool cricket club but because it's due to rain we thought we'll uh, we'll give this a go and just see what we can see there might not be any um, but let's go and have a look you're dancing lewis so walking down now and we've got all the uh, Horses and carriages out for the evening. I'll be hoping that it stays dry for when the illuminations come on. We love living in Blackpool. The lift going up in the tower, all the way up to the top. Lucy's still doing his little dance. And this arcade here, Lewis, yeah. we're going to knock down yeah. in about 18 months' time to build a new big family leisure centre. So that should be quite good. Cool. Still a big kid. So we're just waiting for it to get a little bit darker before we head on up to the top of the tower. They're starting to set up for, um, well that was the end of Lightpool, so they had a big festival of lights. Louis still bouncing around, they're called Lightpool over the half term with lots of lights down here on the comedy carpet. And they're now starting to set up for um, the Christmas markets here and they have a massive star fly, which I think is the biggest in the UK, comes down. Um, so Lewis might actually get to go on the Starflyer this year, we've never been on it, he's not been tall enough the other years. So hopefully we'll get on the Starflyer. Right, we'll just wait another few minutes, another 10-15 minutes for it to go dark and we'll uh, head up to the top of the tower and uh, the 4D theatre bit first. You do me mate. Right, let's, uh, let's go in. So it's level 5 for the Blackpool Tower A. Eh? So we're going to go and jump in the lift. Ooh, scary. <laughs> okay, so we've lost Lewis. He's gone running off out of the lift. Oh my God, he is such a big kid. Come on, dude, let's go. I think it's time for us to go up the tower. Well, first of all, go and do the 4D show. Hi, guys. Okay, so we just had the passes scanned and then there's a green screen there where they make you look like you're uh, climbing the tower. Right, come on, let's go and get in the queue for the, uh, the 4D show, which is very random, this show. We've been here, we came earlier in the season, so check out the vlog. Um, but we thought we'd do a, a winter one. Love these historical uh, photos. Look at that one of the tower been built there. And then the ballroom. You what? It's a tower circus, that which again. Years ago. No, it's over 100 years ago. Because I used to work here when it was its 100th anniversary in 1994. So, what's going on there? Hi. Fabulous. Cheers. Thank you all. You what? No. So, look, this is actually part of the tower uh, right behind you. You can knock on. It's a tower structure. Lucy's climbing the tower like King Kong. And then we're just in this waiting area here now for the uh, the 4D cinema to start. Put them on the right way round. I think they're a little bit big for you then, dude. Looks like Neo out of Matrix. Now the guy's up. The guy's called Square. Obviously there's no videoing in here so we won't be able to video you uh, the experience but we'll show you around the theatre at least. So I'll give you his thoughts on the way out. We've seen this before, it's a bit random isn't it? It adds to the experience. 
Random. Why is he an Isle of Man bitching there? Random. Good though. Could half it. So now we're going to go and get in the lift. This is the scary bit. Oh, we're going to have to get in the lift. A little bit of a queue. Oh, there's a little bit of a queue. Really well themed up here though. Are you excited, Lewis? <laughs> huh? Only been, you've only been a couple of times. Waiting for the lift. A bit of a squitch. No. <laughs> Here we go. Wow, look at that, man. Look at the illuminations, how nice do they look? Oh, some fireworks going off in the background. Can you see them? Yeah, that's what I thought when we'd come up tonight and see if we could see fireworks going on. Right, we'll pause until we get to the stop. What's going on? I don't know, somebody launching fireworks over here. Mate, Whoa, I still don't like this, it still freaks me out every time. No, we don't like it. Oh, and it shows you where everything is and what you're looking at. Can you see Blackpool Football Club? And does it show you the, the ground? One hour later. I'll pause it until he finds it. Hey, there it is. Oh yeah, BSE. Look at all these fireworks going off, mate. No one's this thing, the longest time ever. I think he's found Preston. You, you might have some followers from Preston, they might just have oh, delighted. <laughs> That's cool. So I definitely recommend coming up the tower at night. And fireworks, right? Loads of fireworks going off, mate. Also a bar up here. So we're going to go and have a look at the other side. Oh, you're going upstairs first. Right, we're going to go outside then. Go on, Guy, go in. Everybody can see your bum. <laughs> it might be a bit chillier out here. Sometimes the views are better from the glass because of the netting. Let's have a look. Go. Is it okay? Is it drying? Oh, wow, it's amazing out here. Still think the views are better from the glass because you can. What's that? It was where you could look, uh, it had a... Looks like a fire. Can hear all the fireworks going off. Go around to this other side. Ah, it was a good idea to come up here with the fireworks going off. Now there is a big display at the cricket club that's going to be going off. But I don't think we'll be up here for when, for when that launches. Yes. Nice. Better from downstairs through the glass up. Oh, Lewis wants to go up to the next level. You found the steps? You found the next set? Go up again. Oh look, so we're right in the crow's nest. Right at the top, let's have a look. It's the cold crow's nests. So look, there's one in each corner. It's just starting to rain. One more set of steps, Lewis. Go. This is the highest point you used to be able to go right up to the very top crow's nest. But this is now the highest point that you can go. Well, this is as far up as we can go. One more fireworks. Pretty. 
yeah we'll go back down to the glass but as you can see we're now at 412 feet going down illumination stretching all the way back down there and you can see the two piers central pier there and south pier in the distance more fireworks going off oh, it's ace up here can you see anything Lewis? yeah blackness what? right we're going to make our way down then yeah to the elevator and there's loads of fireworks going off now by the time I get my phone out they all disappear then so hopefully the lift will be here to take us down and then we'll do an outro go 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 that's so we're on the same side as we was when we came up mate Yes. We're now heading back to level six where you'll exit through the gift shop. Thank you. Cheers. As ever, you exit through the gift shop, so this is where you get your photos from when you do the green screen, if you do it. And then there's a gift shop with loads. Yeah, a Blackpool Tower donkey, obviously. Okay, come on, dude, we'll just do another couple of shots at night outside and then we'll do a sign out. Let's go. And they've even got some Tower Dungeon merch. No! Oh. Look at this, look at this. Come on, then, let's go and do a sign out. It's one of your favourites, mate. Zoltar machine. Anybody seen big, they'll know what that is. Okay, and uh, these are the prices for the pick and mix pass. Okay, so we're back down and it's gone dark and the illuminations and Lucy's doing his little dance. How was that for you, mate? Good. Is it good? Do you enjoy kind that? Of kind of boring though. Kind of boring though. Yeah. It's not the greatest bit. I thought it was good to see all the, uh, all the lights and the fireworks. I'm going to do an illuminations vlog with Grandma um, in a week or two's time, so I'm going to put that on the channel as well. Um, yeah, that was good. I'm glad we did that when we saw to see the fireworks as well going off. So, what do we say now? Until we ride to the top of the tower later? Alligator. Alligator. Our hometown of Blackpool.